fastidious vascular bacteria fvb it is also a type of uh, bacteria which causes symptoms in plants uh, now you'll see uh, what are all the bacteria that comes under fvb group and my name is nh shankaradi and i am doing phd plant pathology in anomal university fastidious vascular bacteria is otherwise called as rlvo rickets like organism or rickets like ba bacteria it is also a prokaryotic bacteria and uh, you know uh, there are non motile bacteria they are non motile they can't able to motile because of it contains no flagella the size ranges are uh, measurement uh, ranges from 200 to 300 nanometer in diameter and have a cell wall plasma membrane cytoplasm containing uh, ribosomes and dna strands under obligate here the thing is they can't be cultured this bacteria can't be cultured because they are obligate obligate pathogens cannot be cultured then can, they can only be cultured in a living host or they can only raise in a living host here this bacteria can reproduce by means of binary fission and they are mostly transmitted by insect vectors only they are transmitted sorry they are reproduced by binary fission and they are mostly transmitted by insect vectors only it contains this bacteria this is rlo or it's a like organism contains an enzyme for atp production for atp is adenosine triphosphate it's an energy generator it requires you know for the energy production or energy energy conversion we need atp adenosine triphosphate it's a three molecule phosphate we need adenosine triphosphate whereas penicillin and sulfur drugs are effective against this rlb that is all the kids like bacteria all the kids like organism uh, what are all the examples if you see club root of uh, sorry club leaf of clover citrus greening and the ps disease of grape when these are the bacteria that comes under uh, uh, rickets like organism or fastidious bacteria vascular bacteria so here this bacteria can be divided into two that is xylem limited and phloem limited xylem limited uh, rickets like bacteria and phloem limited rickets like bacteria now we will see xylem limited what are all the symptoms of uh, xylem limited uh, rickets like bacteria marginal chlorosis of leaves stunting of plants decline in vigor and reducing the yield very simple the leaves necro necro which means almost died stunting height of the plant can be reduced and the vigor can be also vigor can also be reduced due to that vigor redu reduction what will happen yield also can be reduced in here xylem limited bacteria are two type that is gram positive and gram negative so in gram positive the example comes under livesonia xylem subspecies xylem that is sugarcane ratun stunting sugarcane ratun stunting this is the diagram we can see here sugar cane ratun stunting is a xylem limited gram positive bacteria which is caused by livesonia xylem subspecies xylem and coming to the gram negative that is prc disease of grape point which is uh, which is the responsible for xylella fastidiosa prc disease of grape point that comes under gram negative xylem limited bacteria these are all the symptoms these are all the symptoms of the bacteria so this uh, xylella fastidiosa this prs disease of grape pen is transmitted by a insect vector called glassy winged sharp shooter glassy winged sharp shooter this is the vector of uh, xylella fastidiosa that is gram negative xylem limited bacteria very simple here fastidious vascular bacteria two type that is xylem limited and phloem limited in here in xylem limited there are two types that is gram positive and gram negative the gram positive that is sugar cane ratun stunting livesonia xylem subspecies xylem very simple and gram negative peers disease of grape one which is caused by xylella fastidiosa and it is transmitted by the insect vector glassy winged sharp shooter the scientific name is homolodesca vitrepennis and then is phloem limited the symptoms which include as usual of stunting or yellowing of leaves you know uh, very sense of floral parts of premature death all very simple yellowing uh, most common and then uh, you know uh, uh, stunting can be seen in later stage what will happen the plant may die in phloem limited in gram positive bacteria citrus thing is very 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 important citrus greening which is caused by candidatus liberi bacter asiaticus this is a gram negative phloem limited bacteria which is transmitted by psyllids diaphorina citri which is transmitted by psyllids diaphora this is the psyllids the partial greening and partial yellowing of fruits can be seen the complete yellowing of leaves with a partial greening that's why it's called citrus greening greening and alteration of greening and yellowing symptoms can be seen on leaves as well as fruits that is the symptoms of uh, uh, citrus greening transmitted by psyllids diaphora citri